In a data science project, it is important to test your code for three reasons. To make sure the code works as expected, to make sure the updated code is free of error before putting it into production, to make it easy for your teammates to understand what your functions do by looking at your tests. In this video, we're gonna go through the examples for each of these reasons. Your code might run without any error, but it can still produce an output that is different from what you expected. For example, here I have a function extract sentiment. This function will extract sentiment and the output will be between negative one and one, where negative one is very negative sentiment and one is very positive sentiment. Instead of trusting that this library will do what I want it to do, I need to double check with multiple edge cases to make sure it works as I expected. So I might want to check if the function extract sentiment will predict the sentence I think today will be a great day to be positive and whether this function will predict the function I do not think this will turn out well to be negative. Another reason for testing is that if you change the code in a function, you can run all the tests that you created previously to make sure that it pass all the tests before using the new code in production. Another benefit of using tests is that others can understand what your functions do by looking at the test. For example, by looking at these two tests, I understand that the function extract sentiment will produce the output that is a numerical and by looking at the test for test content world, I know that this function will output a boolean. Thank you for listening. In the next video, you will learn how to use PyTest to test your functions.